five wins on the bounce for Aberdeen at home. Dundee United, too, have been in sensational form of late. Eight wins in the last nine games in all competitions. Brian Graham now into the middle. Anderson didn't get much on that. Peyton! Calmly curled into the bottom corner. Well, the temptation is so often just to hit that with power. But he kept his nerve and poise and just passed it into the corner, guided it beyond Langfield. Robson, great ball in, and there's Niall McGinn to level things up seven minutes into the second half. A perfect delivery, and the drought is over for Niall McGinn. His first goal since the 21st of December. Kenny McLean with the free kick, left-footed, goes all the way to the back post as Jason Naismith hammers it back and finds the net inside three minutes. Jason Naismith, the 19-year-old, head down, drilled it hard and low. Shinny's corner, and it's headed into his own net by Darren McGregor. Draper takes the credit, but it was McGregor's header. The man on the line, Conor Newton, couldn't keep it out. Mackay. Now Vincent, who scored against St Mirren here on the opening day of the season. Injury problems since then, really. Raven. Polworth. Back it comes to Polworth, who scored a delightful goal at Tannadice in midweek. Cross to the back post. Mackay. Missed by Vincent. Tansy! And Inverness are in front. 34 minutes played. Greg Tansy has his second goal since returning to the club. Thompson, McCausland back into the middle, and it's Kelly. St Mirren find their equaliser just over an hour played. Sean Kelly with his second goal for the club. Lasley up towards Moore. He's done well. Up against Closey. Good strength from the youngster. Now Ainsworth. Reed is the willing runner down to the corner flag. Knocked in towards Francis Angol. Vigers hits it. Comes back to Ian Vigers. And it finds its way through Craig Sampson. Too much power in the shot for the Kilmarnock goalkeeper. And Motherwell are ahead. And it's Ian Vigers. Eremenko. Irvin. Space for Jackson Irvin to go into. Oh, great ball through. It's Rory McKenzie and it's 1 1. A calm finish by Rory McKenzie, his fourth of the season. Great work by Jackson Irvin to assist. Eremenko to Slater. Motherwell have been caught too far up the pitch. Slater, he's got options. One of them could be to go it alone, and Craig Slater. Five minutes into stoppage time has won the game for Kilmarnock. It's the last kick of the game. And what a moment to score your first goal in senior football for Craig Slater. Ambrose. Now to Brown. A good tackle by Carey. They've got three in this attack now. Ross County. Deleu to the left. It comes to the Dutchman. Melvin Deleu! Ross County are ahead after just 15 minutes and it's Melvin Deleu who's got so now four goals in his last seven games and Celtic shocked by Ross County after Brown lost it in midfield the Celtic have only dropped four points at home this season Stokes over the top Commons was away there now Johansson wins it back. Griffiths, Griffiths, and panned out by Brown, and Chris Commons is there to follow in. Celtic have found the equaliser. 34 minutes played, Griffiths shot, Brown, former Celtic player, could only palm it out, and Commons was there 
to net his 27th goal of the season, six in his last five games. St Johnson's 1-0 victory over St Mirren on Tuesday night was their fourth win in their last five games. Erskine diverts that to McLean, and now Stevie May deflected! 1-0 St Johnson, Stevie May gets number 23 of the season. And it was aided by a wicked deflection off Jordan McMillan. Piccolo launches it high. Taylor, pest as ever for the defenders. Lawless. Elliott comes on for Doolan. Oh, and they found the equaliser. Into stoppage time. And it's Chris Doolan who scored on this ground back in September. It's a late, late leveller for Partick Thistle. It's a game that takes on new levels of significance. Defeat for Hearts, and they are relegated from the Premiership. With Patterson, right-footed, Stevenson, and Carrick! Oh, what a start for Hearts! It's Dale Carrick, the 19-year-old, and just look what it means to him. Look what it means to them. It is the perfect start for Hearts. Six minutes played. Patterson's cross delicately nodded down by Stevenson. And Dale Carrick was onside. And the youngster fires Hearts into a lead. And boy, did they need that. Pulsating start to the game. Stanton gives it away to Robinson and they can break here. Nicholson, he's got Stevenson, who's got King, one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper, Billy King. It's Ryan Williams and tucks it home. It is going to be a victory for Hearts in the derby. Look at the passion on Gary Locke's face. It means the world to him. And Hearts have staved off the threat of being relegated by their dearest rivals. Nicholson to Stevenson, the first time ball was key. The ten men of Hibernian short at the back. Stevenson's first time ball to Billy King, who was all alone in the middle and he kept his cool.